Hello, sunshines. The ladies and I were talking about really adding some red carpet romance for our customers to really woo them, serve them, so they become stark, raving, mad fans of yours and cannot wait to buy. Okay, that's what we're sharing today. That's what I'm excited to talk about because we know as network marketers, as women building our businesses online using social media, women are starting to chomp at the bit. They are prepared to be spending their money. They know this is coming. So there are millions and billions going through social media. And don't you want a piece of the pie? Don't you want to be able to serve your friends and family and give them fabulous deals? Because if they're not buying from you, they're buying from someplace else or from somebody else. So why not you? So how can we woo your friends and family? How can we red carpet romance them, give them the Hilton hotel treatment rather than Motel 6, and you can get your piece of the pie and feel good by serving them, by helping them along the way? Hello, what's going on? You guys know my name is Roxanne Lynch. I live way over here in beautiful Scotch Creek, beautiful British Columbia, Canada. And I know that there's enough success and sunshine out there for us all. So even if you're not part of my most amazing tribe and team with social retail, running an e-commerce business with me online, um, I know the tips I'm gonna give you, you can apply within your own circle, okay? So definitely. Um, you're gonna love it. So the very first thing, we want to begin warming your your customers up. We wanna be warming your friends and family up and giving them that high touch, okay? So if you can imagine if you go into like the Hilton, you know, someone's at the at the door saying like, hey, can I take your bags? Oh, would you like a cup of tea? Here's some, uh, or some coffee, or would you like a bottle of water while we get settled? Offering the kindnesses, the little gestures like that, you become memorable if you were running a Hilton, okay? Rather than the Hotel Six where, you know, someone just gives you the key, there's the hotel, well, you know, go up the escalator, whatever it is, and you're gone, right? There's no, there's no wooing, there's no love, you know, and that's what we love to do. So find a way that you can begin warming your friends and family up because they, it's like, it's a nice thing to do. You just don't wanna like drop your link going like, hey, Black Friday's coming, buy my stuff. It's like, no, people want a little romance, right? We want a little high touch, especially now, especially right now. So we think about this, how can we do that? The very first thing is we can create um, events and challenges, okay? We all are very familiar with Facebook groups. We're very familiar with the ability to give high touch. So begin warming your friends and family up depending on your niche and the scope of what you want to market, okay? I'm very honored and blessed. I know what my Black Friday specials are, okay? I know what they are. So I know how to build some curiosity. I know how to build some intrigue. I know how to build conversations. But doing events and challenges using Facebook groups and inviting your friends and family to participate is a great way to begin the conversation, to begin becoming memorable, to give this content that is going to create a connection, that creates a conversation that is going to seek to serve, then sell, right? We're going to serve, 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 offer. We're going to give, 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 ask. Just like Gary Vee says, like jab, 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 hook. That's what we're doing, okay? So using events and challenges is a great way to warm up your friends and family, woo to them, give them. And of course, within those events and challenges, what is gonna happen at the end is we're gonna have raffles and giveaways. We are gonna be able to give away prizes, we're gonna be able to give away draws, we're gonna give away product, we can give away gift cards, all that kind of fun stuff. You know, that last month we gave away $5,000, okay? We did um, a raffle of $5,000 and there was no purchase to enter. Since March, we have been giving away $500 a month within our team, okay? So we know this month we're probably gonna give away $500 and a whole bunch of other products and goodies also. So begin with the raffles and the giveaways and make them uh, free to play. Like there's no cash, there's no purchase to enter to win on the raffles and the giveaways. So. It encourages participation. And right now, what are some of the easy things to do? It's like, well, right now we're running that clean eating challenge. You know, all we have to do is snapshot pictures of our food. Okay, it's really easy to participate. And 
at the end of the week, we're going to give away $100, okay? So our, our wellness community has grown by almost 500 people, okay? We have 500 new faces in our, in our group, okay? So that is a great thing because we're just going to give away. And this is just the first week, okay? There's more to come. So next week, we're going to have another little fun event or challenge. And we're going to give away some gift cards. Or we're going to give away some product. We're going to drop some freebies. And we're just giving. It's the season to give, is right? Exactly. It's the season to give. The other one is, is that when we think about this, we started with the um, events and challenges. We're inviting people into a Facebook community. Um, number two, we're doing giveaways and raffles. And the Third part of that, like this is a strategy, right? There is a process to this wooing, right? We just don't pounce on people and ask them to marry us right off the hop. How about we woo them? How about we have some conversations? So the next part of that is knowing that we're gonna create stories and story polls and create those VIP list chats, okay? It's a great way because then um, you have all your favorite people. Yeah, some people are old school and they write them down with a notebook and a pen. But chats are fabulous because they allow that interconnection and community. So we know within our social retail business, we often double or triple um, our business volume compared to any other month out there. So VIP lists and chats, make sure that no one gets left behind. You can't drop the ball when you're just communicating in one little chat and everyone gets all the details. So everyone knows what's going on and the energy is high and it's joyful and it's exciting. And people ask questions and sometimes we're gonna have the shy girls and they'll never ask questions, but you get those bold women that wanna know all the details, all the facts, all the figures, all the savings, and everyone else's questions that they might be too shy to ask get answered. So VIP chats and lists are extremely powerful because then you can have this ability to circle back and you're going to promise them, say like, hey, Christine, I promise, you know, here's an invitation to the next challenge in the event. There's going to be a whole bunch of prizes and giveaways next week. And you know what? I promise I'm going to circle back and I'll reconnect with you and make sure that you know what is coming up next, okay? That is simple verbiage, and it's not complicated, and there's no stress. That's not weird, because we've promised Christine that I'm gonna follow up with her. I promised her I'm gonna circle back, and I'm not gonna break my promise, and I'm gonna write her down, okay? So tip number four is that your Black Friday with your company, especially, um, the, the the website can get laggish. It can get sluggish, right? So I love doing shopping for my customers, okay? Because if your website is sluggish, okay, I um I know our team has almost crashed the website every single two two years ago, three years ago, we crashed it hard, okay? We had to increase our servers, but every time we almost crash the servers or do, it's exciting because it just shows you the growth of what is going on. We're making those IT guys work really hard, but your customer might not want to experience sluggish websites, okay? They don't have the time to sit there and try to order, so we get to play the concierge, Okay, we get to play their shopping concierge. We get to do the pre-orders for them. We get to do the ordering on their behalf. We collect the information. We do the work for them so they don't miss out on the sale. They don't miss out on all the freebies. They don't miss out on a discount because their, their kid was crying and they, and they couldn't sit there uh, wait for the website to refresh. So that's my job. That's my joy as a customer service representative that I can do their, their online shopping on their behalf, okay? So if you have that ability to place orders for your customers, do so. Okay, offer it. It's not weird. We do online shopping all the time. We give credit card information all the time. I just simply say like, hey, hey Shelby, you know what? I just need your, your name, your mailing address, um, your best email. And you know, did you wanna play, uh, pay that with MasterCard or Visa? Because it's just a part of the conversation. We're doing this for them. And Shelby and I know each other for years. She's taken part of some of my workshops. So she knows that I'm going to show up here tomorrow. Okay. She knows that I'm not going to go anywhere. I'm not, I'm not some kind of weird scammer out there. Right. So that is tip number four. Wherever possible, do the shopping for your customer. They're going to be so happy that you did that for them. And they can go off and enjoy the holiday season like they want to. Right. So, Tip number 
Five is sweeten the deal, okay? The difference between someone shopping with you potentially and somebody else might just be the cherry and the whipped cream on top. Okay, you have rolled out the red carpet for them. You have, you know, given them opportunity to win a whole bunch of free products and the events and the challenges. You've done the raffles and the giveaways where they can earn some cash. You, you have them in your VIP list, so they're high touch. You're very caring. You're very serving. Your give, 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 give offer. Serve, 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 and you go forward from that. So we think about other ways to sweeten the deal. Okay, this is my favorite thing to do, is what can I personally do that is above and beyond what my company can do? Okay, what can I personally do? Because this is my business. I can do special things with my business, such as if I have an ultra loyal repeat customer, you know, maybe I can include a small gift. Okay, um, I can order it and send it directly to them. Maybe I can offer to pay the shipping and handling. Okay, so you know, maybe I can offer to do a referral post with them so then they can earn some extra free customer shopping credits and they don't have to answer the questions. I field all the, the answer, all the questions on their behalf on that referral post. And if any woman wants to buy anything, they get all the shopping credits. You know, I have some women that have over $200 of free shopping and I did all the work and they get all the free shopping credits. So they get an amazing discount on what they wanna buy for Christmas, okay? Or something for their kids. Same thing is they can, um, definitely right now is when we should be thinking about little thank you cards, okay? Sending out a happy early holidays and you know include a, a special little love note in it, telling them that like, hey, you know, Black Friday is coming. If you have any Christmas shopping, I would love to be your shopping concierge. These are some of the special promotions that I am offering on top of 30% off of, you know, my, my amazing collagen or, you know, my fat blaster is 20% off in the new flavor, blackberry. And like people want that stuff. So get on my VVIP list. We're going to be doing some events and challenges and raffles and giveaways. Um, just send me a Facebook message and I can grab you an invitation. That is giving. That is red carpet royalty treatment. And you're creating a deeper, more meaningful connection with your customers. And they appreciate it, okay? No one wants that wham, bam, thank you, ma'am, kind of, you know, get in, get out, don't mess my hair, do. When it comes to the Motel 6 treatment, go above and beyond and your business is going to be rewarded, okay, by us giving, by us just giving a little bit more, treating your amazing friends and family and loyal customers, potential customers, fence sitters, all those people, um, they're going to be buying. They know Christmas is coming. And if it's not with you, it's going to be with someone else. So make you um, irresistible, make you irreplaceable, make yourself memorable. So when they're thinking about something, they're thinking about how great you have treated them for all these months coming into Black Friday and the holiday shopping season. So then you become like the go-to person because you've been there all the time before, all the years before. And that's what I love to do. Okay, so that those are my thoughts for tonight because I do know that time is precious. And if you've been wondering really what I do, how I serve, why our team is exploding in this crazy time where most businesses are pulling back the horns and more fretful, um, yeah, this is what we love to do the best, okay? Mwah. I love you guys. You guys have a fabulous evening. If you got some goodness, definitely mash those emojis. You know, invite a friend in to, to view this if they're looking for some inspiration. Um, or definitely send your friend my way if she's looking to build an online business and she's been frustrated or struggling in the past. A simple discovery call costs nothing. I'll even pour the coffee, okay? Mwah. Love you guys. Night night.